a little title toss. Don't do it today. Well, baby, if you are Tasha K, oh, actually, if you were Cardi B, I know you regret honestly even saying anything to Tasha K because, baby, she is not let up yet. Now, listen, it don't listen. Let's get into this mess. Let me bring y'all up. I did a video earlier. Let me bring y'all up to date on what's actually happening now, right? Cardi B, first of all, Tasha K has been going in, right? The girl that said she messed with Offset has some receipts. Suge Knight stepped in and said, no, Offset posted some stuff about somebody that was in Cardi B's Instagrams. What, what, what? And on top of that, Cardi B is staying at her cousin's house or her friend's house in LA, and she's not even staying home. Y'all, let's get into this mess, all right? Okay, so first of all, right? We're all, first of all, we gotta get off. Tasha K started talking about stream Barbie world, stream Barbie world. Cause you know, I will say one thing, Tasha K and Cardi B gonna be enemies till the very end. They get, you know the people, what is it from life? Like the two people that are, no, cause they was friends, Never mind. Anyway, Tasha K posted this, hold on. Tasha K posted this. She said, first of all, she made that song, you going to jail, you going to jail. Tasha K is a fool and I know that Cardi B is just regretting engaging in her like what I, I mm. anyway right Tasha K said from the desk of Tasha K she wants it because if you guys don't know she went on vacation Bondi Blue is hosting Unwind with Tasha K shout out to Bondi right but she said for, so they issued this on this page from the desk of Tasha K <laughs> She wants to sincerely apologize for her less than professional actions on Beyonce's internet yesterday. This is not the example the winos need. So we have enrolled Tasha K into one of Florida's top anger management programs to deal with issues that she faces on social media. Tasha K making sure she not getting so in suit again. Let me tell y'all something. If y'all ever think you're going to get fired from a job, if y'all ever think your actions are going to catch up with you, jump into some sort of rehab. I'm telling you, it'll protect you from the law. Anyway, she said, please note this could this could be you. Social media is a hard landscape to navigate. And given all the recent headlines, Tasha K was bound to snap. And for that, unwind with Tasha K and its affiliates sincerely apologize for her treacherous behavior. She sincerely didn't mean to burn the vineyard down. With that said, her team will continue to post on her behalf for the next seven days while she completes her anger management program. Keep her and her family in your prayers. Remember, no one is perfect. They said Bondi Blue will toast with y'all until Tasha K returns on social media. Wine on, wine on, wine on nation. Then, um, they said from the desk of Suge Knight, swipe. He acts as current fiance Brandy to cease all. She messing with Suge Knight. Suge Knight. Brandy got bigger problems anyway, right? He acts as current fiance Brandy to cease all efforts to expose Offset. He advised Brandy to focus on them. And when he returns home, oh wait, he's locked up. All right, girl, Brandy, get your coin. Suge Knight is locked up. He ain't Debo off the block. Cause I don't know, Brandy's living in LA, right? They said he advised Brandy to focus on them. And when he returns home, he will ensure that more years don't go wasted waiting on someone else's man. Brandy thank everyone for listening to her story now wants privacy with her new man. And they showed a, a message from Suge Knight, allegedly. This is all alleged, right? Talk about some, you're bigger than that BS. Enjoy us. Keep, keep it. G, good night. I guess he was tired when he wrote it. He was sneaking the phone. Then Dr. K posted a video of Brandy showing everything from the front, back, and side. They said from the desk of Brandy, Offset's alleged mistress. Brandy wanted to let all y'all know that she's not 50. Who said this girl, who said this girl was 50? Yeah, listen. <laughs> Do I need to go? Who said this girl was 50? Do I need to get class to give classes on actually picking somebody apart? You can say a lot of things about this girl. 50? Okay. 
She read all your comments. Brandy, why are you reading the comments? Well, I guess she was waiting for Shig to get back with her. So she she is in her late 30s. And she's a blooded Latina. Is she trying to say she's down with the bloods? Like Barty? Okay, anyway, they said Offset never complained once about her look since 2013. Brandy says that looks have never been an issue to Offset given how his wife looks. Suge Knight is enjoying her now with no complaints. Okay, listen, is this girl just clout chasing or does she actually have really... Okay, so get this. This is the last one. Uh, Tasha Kate posted this and said, the moral is don't throw rocks where you live in glass houses. She says in response to alleged houses being taken from Tasha K for months, posted all over social media. Tasha K. And she put a period after that. Tasha K wants y'all to know from anger rehab that she regretfully rejects, <laughs> that she regretfully regrets having to stoop to this level and take pleasure in taking another woman's whole household. She asks for forgiveness for this horrible trans transaction. She prays the couple can get through this for the sake of the kids. This is not her character. Her brand is built on wine, gossip, comedy, black love, and stream Barbie world. Now listen, let me just say this, right? Um, and this is important to say, uh, you know, so what a lot of people said that Tasha K was actually holding on to this okay and that she had it for a while and she was just waiting to break up with this and go in on this all right Suge Knight has gotten into the chat if you guys don't know um Cardi's friend tried to jump on sorry Cardi's friend tried to jump into the fray and say that that house that that girl was posting in it's not the house that cardi stays at but i think that girl brandy again just to be clear was saying that's the house that they run out to practice choreo and stuff like that right something happened because something is going on with cardi b and offset she is staying at i think her cousins or a friend's house in la and she talking about that even if they make her leave offset right and when she's done with them she just going to get another rich a which by the way, has anybody figured out who Offset's talking about? Offset said, I've been seeing them DM to my wife. I'm a run into you, B. Now, here's the thing. If he's saying that, that means this has to be somebody Offset knows. Right? And it sounds like it's somebody Offset knows. But also, Cardi B and Offset, what type of games does this couple play? So they both have access to each other's DMs. And they both let whatever. Mm-hmm. I read somewhere that they might have an open relationship. I do not believe that for a second. Cardi does not play about her man. And also don't seem to be playing with this guy either. So I doubt there was an open relationship. But this is the uh, exchange that got Offset in his feelings. It said, happy B-Day. This is the Cardi B. Enjoy your day, dot, dot, dot. Don't let none throw you off. This is when she did the, the, the what do you call it? The cabaret B-Day. Somebody sent me an invitation. I don't know if it's real or not. And I'd be hearing ish, but from me to you, I'm 100 on every aspect from the biggest ish down to me, even DMing you. I'll never do no cornball ish or even do none to make your people mad, etc. Yo, he begging. Cardi was a joke. No, I say one thing. Remember when Cardi was on that live last night? Not live, but on the clubhouse. And she was like, yo, like, ball players rappers everybody be in my dm their voices be trembling they be like hello hello Cardi," right she said they be trembling they want this mofo is in her dms begging to be a side man let me report pete he said i'll never do no cornball ish or even do none to make your people mad etc guess he couldn't keep that lie he couldn't keep that promise because all set is going off right now i hate when an emma think i'm a f nick Knickerbocker, because I really come from a genuine place. Offset saw those DMs and he's been going off, but it makes me think Offset just just checked her DMs and saw this full in there, right? And again, this morning, Cardi has been staying at her cousin's. Y'all, what do you think about this? And Tasha K is bragging that she 
blew up this woman's whole household. I will say this, right? Cardi ain't leaving Offset until she's ready to. Now, I don't know if she's ready to. Her and Offset are still dealing with a death. I don't know if they're if they're if she's going to. But Tasha K has not let up from her and then she got the nerve to unseriously say that she's in anger management treatment in florida i 100 do believe she's in anger management treatment right now just to make sure no more lawsuits come up if you guys don't know um cardi accused her of embezzling again we said the same thing how you embezzle from your own business right if anything, it can't be embezzling. You pierce the corporate veil because you prove that the business was just a facade for your day-to-day -day dealings. Do you know what I'm saying? But she said that they have proof that she's embezzled. She said that she was going on jail. Tasha K made a remix. Tasha K is so unserious. I just, I don't know, right? I, I, I just don't know why. Tasha, that Cardi B gave Tasha K any play. I guess she's like, I'm gonna help you earn that four million to give to me, right? I mean, at the end of the day, every time Tasha K goes viral, it's going into Cardi B's bank account, but she's going viral off of literally exposing, allegedly, Offset still stepping out. So at this point, is there any winner? Okay, she's making money to pay you, but it's bringing drama to your household. And yeah, Car Tasha, you're going viral, but that money's going to Tasha's household. These people are linked like war and the roses. I do want to say about Offset and Cardi. Did Cardi let Offset know that one of his friends was trying to talk to her, right? And let's not, the, the, let's not forget the defense uh, that her friend Kim Barbie tried to put up on her behalf. That's in that other video. Go watch that, right? I get that that place isn't her home, but clearly... That home is somewhere. Even Suge Knight got, got involved and didn't say anything because I guess it's a known thing that this girl messed with Offset and she is a blooded Latina. Yeah, y'all, listen, what y'all think about this? I just know that this is not over. There's going to be more stuff coming from the desk of Tasha K. Cardi B gonna be getting those royalty, but I know she didn't want it like this. Y'all, listen, I'll keep y'all posted on whatever else is happening. I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.